Hi, it's Roger James Hamilton here, and I have a question for you. Right now, I'm on the Caribbean island of Aruba, where I am remote working, and uh, many other people have chosen to be out here as well uh, to be doing their work from anywhere in the world. And here's the question. What is the chances that there is someone on this island right now who is not as smart as you, they are not as hardworking as you, they're not as talented as you, uh, they may even not be as old as you, they might be a lot younger than you, and they are at 10 times your revenues or 10 times your profits or 10 times the quality of life. There's something in which they already, if not multiple things, 10 times where you are today. And why is this? Why does this happen where each of us are working so hard, uh, trying so hard to actually make things work, and no matter what level of success you're at, there's someone somewhere who's at 10 times that next level. The reason I ask this question is because I want to invite you to come and join us at our Entrepreneur Fast Track, which is a four hour program, which goes exactly into why this happens and what the results of finding the solution is for you as well. And why this is so important right now too. At Genius Group, we have over 2 million students that have been learning tools that allow us them to go from one level and to the next level of success in the things that they are interested in. So let me show you a couple of quick slides so you can decide for yourself if this is something that you would like to be a part of. Uh, first one here is sharing with you that this is something that we put together some years ago and ran live post-pandemic times, sorry, pre-pandemic times, and now post-pandemic times, we are now gonna be running this for the very first time as a digital event. And it's all around this whole concept for entrepreneurs that they need to understand and investors, which is the power of zero. Power of zero is the fact that some things look like nothing, but in fact are everything. Like if you did not speak Japanese, then it would mean nothing to you. But if you decoded Japanese, it suddenly would open up an entirely new world. And exactly the same way, when you add a zero to whatever your number is right now, it does transform everything. If you think about what would happen today in terms of what you do differently in your business, if you had 10 times revenues or in your job, if you had 10 times the income, uh, what would you do differently in terms of having 10 times the impact in the world or even 10 times the time off that you would like to have as well. At every one of these different levels, 10 times quality of life, 10 times relationships. If you were to say, well, if I could just make that shift, I would do it, but it's not that easy. Well, I'm here to tell you that I really do believe that when you understand that the difference of someone who's going at 100 kilometers an hour to 10 kilometers an hour, may be nothing to do with their effort, but to do with whether or not they're in a car as opposed to on a bicycle or at 1,000 kilometers an hour that they're on a, a rocket ship. Once you understand that it's the vehicle you choose, we can see why it is that some people who are not even at the same age as us, are actually able to generate so much more than us as well. So there's a number of different vehicles. And what we're going to do over the four hours is I'm going to introduce to you what is the vehicles that those people who are taking an exponential path in these exponential times, what is it they're doing differently? Uh, this is something which is called moonshot thinking. How do we actually think differently by having a rocket ship instead of being on a bicycle? And I'm going to be sharing with you something called the impact meter, which we have now been using to great success all around the world, which shows exactly how there are seven different levels from one customer up to a million customers in a company. And even if you're in a job, which means you've got one person paying you, one customer, that's your boss, all the way through to actually having your own small business, then getting up to a high level business as well, that every one of these different levels gives you something at 10 times the impact. But not only that, they come with 10 times the complexity, which means what you need to be solving is actually different from the level down below. I've seen many people get stuck at a level here for years and years and years. And when you suddenly realize, oh, it's because my winning formula actually is now my losing formula. Pedaling harder is not going to get me 10 times faster, right? So then we actually realize I've got to change my vehicle. And the good news is there's always a way to do it. In fact, new people are starting new vehicles all the time. And I'm going to share with you exactly how each one of these different levels links into something called the impact highway, how that links into metrics at each level as well, and how you can be using something that I developed over 20 years ago called Wealth Dynamics to find your natural path to where you want to be getting to on these levels, together with linking it to a concept called the Kigai, which is a Japanese concept of a reason for being. How do you turn your day's work into your life's work? and doing this on a day-by-day -day basis so you really can have the impact in the world that you wanna have. So a couple of things just to share without going through the detail here, every single one of these levels has got what you do and what you don't do for every part of your business. It is gonna show you and be very eye-opening at realizing that the things that you shouldn't be doing probably are the things that you have been doing. And that we're gonna be sharing also many people from around the world giving their success stories and also their experiences. And just to give you a few examples, 
Here's a story of them and Demery. They basically are in Australia starting with a company which they wanted to get out of, which was an accounting company. They've now totally ch changed what they're doing into something called Grow CFOCO, where they actually had their profits going up 714% within the first two years. Chad Pope starting from not even a percentage because he had zero to start with. And then after seeing what the exponential trends are, set up a new business called Cashbox, which did $12 million in investment funds in its first 12 months. Uh, another example here, Jonathan Boyd, who was really big in music, set up a guitar tutoring company, which actually went from zero to a million revenues in 10 months. And now he's going to be hitting more like five to six million this year. Um, this here in New Zealand is a story of Beryl, who has a business that was already getting close to a million dollars, but she's been stuck for many years. She's broken right through that over the last couple of years, now more like two and a half million because she realized the one thing that she should have been focusing at, which was how to build a team, was something she'd been doing all wrong. Once she shifted that and changed her levels, then her level went up as well. And final story I'll share here is Jim Becker, who uh, started where his business was already much bigger, 56 million in size. It now is at 120 million two years later. Again, by just understanding the distinctions of what you need to be doing differently in your business from what you might be doing right now as well. So we're gonna go through in four hours. What is the impact meter? How you can use it, which level you're at. We're gonna take a test so you can find out where that is. I'm going to give you a link to the Wealth Dynamics test so you can find out which of the eight different profiles is your natural path and what are the biggest trends going on in global business right now that you can then be using and the people you can be partnering with to make that difference. So whether or not you're a startup entrepreneur where you're just getting going or you'd like to start your business, whether you already have an established business like Barrow and Jim that you're now looking to scale to the next level, uh, whether you are someone that actually already is looking to partner up with us or with our team in some way or even an investor looking for smarter ways to actually work on your investing, the most important thing right now is to realize that whatever has got you to where you are is most likely the thing that's stopping you from getting to the next level. So just like I started with a question, let me finish with a question, and then you decide for yourself if you'd like to come and join us, and I really hope you do. Uh, the big question I am going to finish with is, what do you think the possibility is that you could be operating right now at less than 10% of your true potential? And what's the chances? Like, in fact, there's ways that you could get 10 times bigger by just reaching your potential. But for so many of us, we are so stuck right now with our old way of doing things. We go, there must be a better way. And if you think, yeah, I think that's probably true. Like, it could be that I'm spending my time worrying about or doing the wrong things, that if I shifted that, that could change everything. Then if you're at that point, then let me help you unlock that potential, come along for the four uh, hour program. Uh, I know you're going to get huge value. Uh, and then you're also going to be meeting some amazing entrepreneurs from around the world that are going to be joining us as well. See you soon on our entrepreneur fast track. And thank you very much for watching.